Hi there, I'm Romeo. And I'm Wilma, and this is a new episode of Trustbusters. Behind us is our friend Trussy. Did you meet Trussy already? Oh, no. But he's in our new exhibition booth. Exactly. Our new exhibition booth has also a three meter truss pole with a lightning fixture on top. With that, we're going to do some tests today. Cool, let's test. Perfect. Have you ever been at an exhibition and had the feeling that not everything is set up correctly? Oh! Wilma, what did you do? You killed our friend Trussy. Well, I have a solution for that. He will be back soon. Okay, I really hope so. But why didn't you use a base plate? Robert? Well, actually, that was the whole point of the video, so of our testing. Well, then it would be good to do a next test with base plate. We will do that. As I told you, we got Trussy back together. I'm really happy about that. Well, we knew this was going to happen since we didn't use a base plate. Uh, so make sure you always use a base plate, but also take into consideration that you use a blind base plate. Right, Romeo? What were you saying? Well, in the last deaths, at least we kept Trossi alive, but it yep. was a very dangerous situation since we didn't use the right base plate. Okay, so we should try and explain what happened actually. In order to understand the stability issue of our system, we need to define the most important element, which is the center of gravity. This is the point through which the force of gravity acts on our system. Being in the same position with the center of mass as well, we can define it as the point where all the weight of the system is concentrated. Beside the center of gravity, another important factor is the base and its outermost contact point. We can use these two elements to determine exactly when the system will reach its tipping point and will fall over. We can notice that when using a larger and heavier base, like the steel base plate, the position of the center of gravity lowers substantially, this making our system way more stable. The role of the center of gravity can be highlighted even better when simulating a ground support base with short or long outriggers. To conclude, a low position center of gravity and a large base will normally result in a safe and stable system. So, two solutions would be either choosing a steel base plate or if you want to be completely sure you can use a base with short or long outriggers. If we would apply the same force that we did in the last test, nothing would happen. Okay, so now you see, with applying even more force, nothing happens and everything is safe. So, thank you for watching. And see you at the next episode of Trustbusters.